separate matter, you mentioned uh, what you see as a win at the UN Security Council. Right. I'm curious as to why you believe this is a win. Uh, after all, this particular resolution did not pass. Uh, right. You look at what's happened at the UN Security Council in the past, for instance, the Security Council resolution, which gave the green light for the Persian Gulf War, you actually had all five permanent members of the UN Security Council voting yes. So why are you saying this is a win uh, when not all five permanent members of the Security Council actually voted yes? You had one, Russia, blocking it. Well, I, I think it's very significant, China's abstention in particular. I think Kazakhstan's another one in terms of that one, in terms of its proximate location and history with Russia. You see a breakaway uh, of Russia aligning itself with a position that is not only shared with the U.S. but the rest of the world. Uh, so that would be a natural position that they might have taken in the past. Uh, but secondly, I think China's abstention is a significant win for the president. He went down and had discussions with President Xi, um, and, and I think you all saw that, heard his remarks about how he walked through um, that, and I think it, it really shows uh, the success of the trip, first and foremost. But secondly, uh, it continues to show how Russia is isolated on this particular matter. That's important. Uh, so I think on a variety of fronts, uh, it really uh, was a huge win for the United States and for the persuasiveness of the President. John Gizzi. Yeah. Thank you, Sean. Um, in his remarks to us off camera,